Hello people, welcome to the video, welcome to the channel. If you're new, please hit that like and subscribe. Today we're talking about some Jeepers Creepers news. We're going to get straight into the article. Sorry if I sound a little bit down in this video, I haven't been feeling great. And uh, this is the first video I've made in probably like two weeks. So, also, the news I'm bringing you today isn't the best of news, so I'm just a pretty, uh, as you, how, how would you call it, upset with the news. I hope you enjoy the gameplay here. This is some Call of Duty World at War um, Nacht der Totem gameplay, I believe, um, is what you'll be watching. Thanks for watching this video, guys. As I said, please like, subscribe, and comment if you wish to comment. And let's uh, try and make this community uh, as friendly and as large as we can make it, right? But anyway, one of the biggest questions regarding the cost of Jeepers Creepers Reborn is whether or not Jonathan Brett, who is basically un unrecognizable under the creature makeup, will be returning to play the Creeper. More than any of the humans in the film, the Creeper is the enduring figure. Well, obviously. It's the only character who appeared in all three films, and Breck's intimidating physical performance has been the defining feature of the franchise. Yes, of course it has. Of course it has. The Creeper is a classic horror villain, um, thanks to Jonathan Breck. When rumours about fourth installment were swindling in the summer of 2020, horror fran fra fan site iHorror spoke to Breck's agent about his possible involvement in the upcoming movie. His agent, res his agent responded with... There's nothing to say really. We have had no contact with anyone. However, that doesn't mean that something isn't being worked on. Right, so this article was released in early this year. This article came out the 25th of Feb, um, early this year. Unfortunately, there has been another source which has leaked some information, basically saying, um, basically saying the same, but this is like updated information that, again, so Jonathan Breck's agent has responded, and he has responded with the quote saying, unfortunately the rumours are true, that Jeepers Creepers 4 has been shot. From what I can tell, it was done very, very low budget and under the radar. Jonathan was not a part of it, uh, neither was anyone from any previous incarnations. It looks like it was made just to milk the franchise, very unfortunate, but true. My guess would be that it's probably not a very good movie. It's unfortunate that Jonathan will not be back as the Creeper. So, yeah, pretty much official. Uh, this article that I'm reading now also states, According to Variety's reporting, filming of Jeepers Creepers Reborn took place in Louisiana this past December and January. So that means it was completely shot and finished in 2020 they're probably still editing it now um and they want to drop it this fall i re i haven't heard anything about this movie it says a full release window for this horror movie initially brings to mind the possibility of a halloween adjacent premiere that's not going to happen they're not going to compete with terrifier 2 scream 5 and halloween kills it's not going to happen um that's if this even gets a theatrical release because by the sound of it I was actually looking forward to this I was really looking forward to this movie I was hoping that we'd get a uh, Jonathan Breck announcement obviously not so the f and apparently they didn't even ask him they didn't even ask him that's the worst part about this um, that's like doing a Nightmare on, Elm Street, a Nightmare on Elm Street movie and not even asking Freddy Krueger sorry not even asking um, not even asking Robert England or casting Jason Voorhees and not even asking um, not even asking Kane Hodder. To be fair, I actually really like Derek Mears as Jason. But uh, yeah, it's like not asking Jason Mears to do the next Friday. Or not, ask, not even asking Kane Hodder. Because Kane Hodder's still in horror. He's still, he's, I think he plays uh, Victor Salva. <laughs> Victor Salva. No, he doesn't. Victor, uh, not Victor Crowley. It is Victor Crowley. Yeah, he plays Victor Crowley. Oh, that was a funny slip of the tongue. It's because we're talking about Jeepers Creepers. Uh, I won't make that mistake again. Um, yeah. So, yeah, as I said, I, I defended this movie. You know, I, I, I made a video about it a while ago saying that you should always separate the art from the artist. Um, which is what they were trying to do. Uh, different director. But, you know, are you really going to bring that into Jonathan Breck? Like, you don't want, any, you don't, you don't want Jonathan Breck in it? Because of something the director did, and no returning cast at all. Jeepers Creepers Reborn is going to be like a shitty prequel. You know how like 
Hell, um, is it Hell, Hell Seeker? Revelations. It just, it just sounds like Hell Ra Hellraiser Revelations to me. It sounds like it's just going to be a really cheap, low budget knockoff, B Tech version. What's the point? I haven't seen any material for this, like marketing material at all. Um, haven't heard anything about it. Haven't really heard any big names connected to this, so yeah, this is a real kick in the teeth. I'm I'm not really, not really too happy about this. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed. Make this little community just a little bigger. Peace.